Without further ado this evening, will we be checking out a small film by the girl, the woman, the mukbang madness herself, Foodie Beauty. Tonight's short horror by Foodie Beauty is called Smiley Pete's. It is a short horror film. With this, I ask you, please leave your comments respectful, non-disheartening, or mean. For we have became under the under eye of YouTube. Without further ado, let's get started and see what this madness brings. And maybe if it's not too long, we'll check out a tour at all. Will it be a? it all. <laughs> we skipped through the music because we've got to be good in these days, if you feel me. Let's get to it. Three it. Four it. Five it. All I skipped. for my dogs. I hope you can't hear it. I have not seen this short film. I was waiting for you guys. So we're in this together. If I'm being a little silent. playing a prank. <sighs> Better lock it. <laughs> Even though we are in Canada. <sighs> what, what does being in Canada have to... What does that have to do with anything? Shall we move on? Got some light, 
Stop being a baby. You're hearing things. It's Halloween. Better shut the door. This sounds like a regular something that we've seen. Very familiar, if you know what I mean. This is literally her it's life. Anyway. <sighs> Why does my phone have to be in the other room? <sighs> this is literally... This is very realistic for a film. catch a glare but the minute smiley Pete's came into the picture i'll rewind a little bit it, it glared out they should have put a ring light on or something watch it, it glares out hardcore they she's got better lighting she should it literally you see the glare of the kitchen light i mean i know you know we got this tablet but check it out it's like see the glare I mean, that's the kitchen light. Oh, Simon. Stop. Simon just seen Smiley Pete's. Okay, um, it was, it was something, <clears throat> excuse me, um, wasn't a mukbang, um, I don't know, maybe there will be a part two, um, like to dislike ratio turned off, um, it isn't creepy. I came to watch. This was great. I was actually scared. I'm sleeping with the lights on. I'm more scared of myself right now. <laughs> Two videos in one day. A horror... Sh <clears throat> excuse me. A horror short film... Your vids absolutely make my day. The first of many Beezer Productions. Low-key, the sliding door kind of scared me. Yikes. Um... They love it as usual. <laughs> of course they do. Who would have thought? Um... It's definitely better than a mukbang. I'll, I'll say that. Um, but. Yeah. I don't know. I It's okay. It, it, the lighting from the kitchen when he came through really glared out. I know he got the tablet. But there was different parts in it where the light even. You know with the tablet glared out. Much better than a mukbang. Um. Definitely the best Halloween content yet. Let's go ahead and um, take a look at Torrid. Um, we're not going to 
Yikes. We are going to skip through where she shows the clothes and we'll actually go to the try on. Um, whoa. Look where I stopped. Stopped right at the undies. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I guess I've showed brawls on here. I don't know if I've showed underwear, but I don't really... I don't know. But, um, yeah, let's go ahead and get on to the try-on portion. Um... All right. So I'm going to try them with the dress. I got really wide. Oh, so that should she's got a new wig. Okay, let's discuss this right quick here. Wait a minute. <clears throat> Excuse me. Wait a minute. Weren't we just talking about wigs and bad wigs and people that wore wigs that really didn't wear wigs the other day? And now we're wearing wigs. I'm a little confused here. Makes any sense? Never usually does, but okay. And I did do all this myself. I'm. Let me turn a little light action on here. I'm quite uh, proud of myself. I think my makeup was a uh, more scary. Hold on, I don't know if you're catching it, but. Yeah, quite a... This is the first time I ever did anything like this, so... It's all real. It's not, um... It's all real, you know what I mean? It's not decals where you just pill and stick. I literally did this myself. Added all the, you know... Added all the things. I don't want to give them away, but... Yeah, I... Didn't do too bad, eh? I think I'm a bit more scared of myself than the film, but... Shall we move on to the torrid, hopefully not horrid hall? And let me say this up front. I'm not talking about the person. I could be talking about the clothes. So we do not shame over here. We do not do things like that. We just give our opinions and our thoughts. Thank you. Let's do this. Sit. Hopefully but we'll see, so. All right, guys. These Let's boots were made for mukbanging, and that's what they'll do. These boots are gonna get KFC gravy all over you. Jim. Oh, no, Jim. I thought I skipped all this. You're snubbing me. I need you to help me set up for my videos. Oh, Lord have mercy. Fine. No tuna tours for you tonight. Yeah, that got your attention. I don't know if you'll be able to see the boots here. These boots are made for mukbanging, and that's what they'll do. do One Lund of these days, the these boots are going to get I gravy all over dress. you. Let me just back up so you can see the boots. <laughs> dress isn't bad. Let me just pause. Dress isn't bad. It's not bad here. I don't like the boots, but they would be good, maybe, winter boots. But I don't like them with the dress. But moving right along, let's stay positive. I love the boots. Sorry, I, I don't know. I I've always did that sometimes. Even as a kid, I like... It's don't ever get offended. Like, I have just always made up, like... Not voices, you feel me? But I don't know. I've always made up accents. I've even heard Miriam talk about that. Shout out to Miriam. But I've... I don't know where it comes from. It's it's not... I'm not trying to disrespect anybody. I'm not making fun of anyone's language. I just... I don't know. So, sorry. I know you probably catch it once in a while. And sometimes the voice is like... I try to do one accent and it protrudes into another accent. But... Uh, check out my Foodie Beauty Halloween parody if you're new. I did one last year. It's quite a ways back, and I did a cheese cemetery. So check out my new Halloween uh, Life by Jen Chaffles recipe parody. And uh, it's like a comedic. If you don't know, I've said this before, what a parody is. It's a comedic skit. It's not to make fun of anyone. It is a comedic skit. 
skit. Thank you. Oh, we're feeling fresh. Pop, lock, and drop it. Oh, what? What? Uh-oh. She really... Did she hear me? She was about to pop, lock, and drop it. Uh-oh. Somebody's filling it. Somebody's filling it. Uh-oh. Okay, now what I was going to say is... um, I do like the dress. Boots, I think. I'd leave them winter. Leave them snow boots. Um... Boots. I don't know. See, I don't know where that is. That, that wasn't even I was trying to make up. Boots. Leave the boots for walking and let them book bang and do. Um, where's she going to wear this dress? I mean, I'm not trying to... Where are we wearing this dress? Um, the only thing I've noticed with Torrid is their fabric is very thin. Or, very thin. Slow down, Kaya. The fabric is very thin, I've noticed. Um, and this is towards, you know, nobody. I I've noticed this. Any The fabric's very see-through. Um, I've seen a couple Toradols, different people, and um, different, you know, communities. But the fabric seems very thin. The clothes, let me know if you've had any torrid stuff. Some of it just doesn't seem very well made, and I'm not trying to run down any company. You know, shout out to torrid. Holler at your girl. I'll try on some stuff, but, you know, there's some stuff I just see that doesn't, but, um, let's move along, shall we? Uh-oh. Work it out. Work it out, girl. Work it out. Hey. Pete's is going to absolutely love it. He is going to want to spin you around and watch you pop, lock, and drop it. But make sure you pick it back up. Uh-oh. Get it. Foodie beauty. Hey. Very nice. Sorry, I don't want it. Okay, so I noticed a couple things lately. Look, she is digging this. Look at the smile on her face. I kind of, this is, it's, it's better than eating, man. It, it, it is now. I will say this, and this is only my opinion. I'm not saying this in a negative stature. She has gained some weight. I mean, I'm not going to lie here, but she's upbeat. You know, she's, she's. Pop locking and dropping. Hey. And um I noticed the other day she said something. I think it was the um Jolly Bee. That uh something about bringing food home for I gotta so I don't have to cook for Pete's now. Uh, 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 uh. I thought that she said if she what was it? If you guys remember something about I only worry about feeding somebody when I'm with them or when I'm dating them. Um, it was something like that, don't quote me, but have we officially got back together? This is only my opinion. These are not facts. But, uh, no, this is way better than eating, so uh, props on the, the, the horror film. Props on this. Let's scootle do. She that is was, loving this dress. Okay. By the way, guys. And, and that's, let me, let me say this on a positive note, because my family bet me I couldn't say anything positive. My, my family don't, they just don't get, like, they think, like, you guys are being mean. Well, they don't get the back action to all this, you know, so let's do our positive comment of the day here. I do like that she's in a happy mood. I do like that she likes the dress, but... We don't want to settle for keep, <clears throat> excuse me, you don't want to settle for keep getting bigger and bigger and bigger sizes. Don't settle, you know, if, if you're not happy, and, and right here she's, you know, being joyous, having a good time, but do I deep down inside think she's happy? We all, come on now. So, don't settle, you know, to get bigger and bigger sizes. So, let's move on. But my 
fat fan on, <laughs> just like they do at Torrid, so you might hear that in the background. I hope not. Okay, and just, just, just that comment, it, it's weird that came at this time, sorry. I've got my you-know-what fan on. I'm going to rewind it here in a second because I know I was in between moving around. But I've got, let me just say this and then I'll shut up. Wait, wait. I've got my you-know-what fan on like they do at Torrid. So we're settling just because Torrid is catering to, you know, and that's great and everything to have a, you know, fan in the dressing, excuse me, room. But like I said, we're, we're, we're settling. Do you know what I mean here? We're, we're settling. Because Torrid's got a fan. Oh, I, you know, I've got my fan like Torrid. You get what I'm, you get what I'm throwing out here, baby? But, here. Uh -huh. My bad, we'll go a little bit. Can I'll I block and drop it. Hold on. Okay. Hold on. Oh, my bad. Fat fan on, <laughs> just like they do at Torrid, so you might hear that in the background. I hope not, but you never know. She just saying, Sam, what are you All doing? Right guys. So, this is outfit number two. Okay, time out here. Remember what I just said about the fabric. Sorry, every time I look at myself, I'm like, whoa, yippee, yikes. Um, What's what's uh, Kramer saying? Seinfeld, Yamaha. Um, you also have to, and this is for anybody, any shape, even me. I've noticed. Um, you guys know I got my little Halloween Halloween leggies on here. Let me show them here. And if you can see them, a little Halloween legsters. There you go. There you go. Reel it in. Um, sorry, I didn't mean to put you right down there. Um, let me. Keep a PG, PG friendly around these parts. Um, anyways, what I was saying is you have to watch about stripes. Different stripes can cause different illusions. No matter what shape, what size you are, I'm not saying this just for her. I'm saying that even I have dresses and, you know, different stripes create different illusions. I forget which way they go. They can do different things, you know, but I'm over here pop locking and... You guys, I have been busting my tail today. I'm, I'm, we're about to get back to it. It's not that long. I have made a pie, did the parodies. Did This took a minute. And guess what? I got to take this off before I lay down. And all this, you know, isn't bad because, you know, but this got to rip off, so... Love you guys. If I look a little rough and raggedy on the skin tomorrow, you know why. All right, come on out. Fabric is see-through, guys. On. See it? We have the leggings. Very comfortable, nice fitting. I don't like the leggings. The shirt's not the shirt. too bad. It's so, it's long. It's like a two But, shirt. what I've noticed is we're doing this number here we know another person that when they do torrid hauls they pull and tug no don't go down that road no like i said don't settle man don't it's, it's see-through it. <laughs> it's see-through so... foodie not to be I don't like the leggings. Yes. Her, her, her legs, okay. and, and I'm not saying this again to be mean. Her legs are short. So, and I'm not saying that to be mean at all. That's just, you know, a feature. Like, their legs are short. I'm not saying that to be mean. I hate what's going on. And that I have to... Everything. But anyways, um... Yeah, the leggings just don't, I don't like the leggings. The stripes, they're they are like going different ways because, you know, 
I don't know. I don't like the leggings. Her legs are short. I'm really not digging the leggings. I would have got a flat print legging or not something with stripes, but the shirt is see-through, and, and I do like the shirt, so let's so, yeah. scoot on do. It's nice and thin material. It's not too hot. Um, it does have like a turtleneck kind of look. I love the leggings. The nice pattern on them. Yeah. It's like leggings, but fancy leggings. <laughs> and these are so warm and comfortable. I am a comfy legging wear, maybe the grocery store, maybe just, you know, running errands, but I don't think there's a thing as fancy leggings. I mean, there's, there's some better than not, like, these obviously are just, you know, my chillin' Halloween leggings, you know, would I wear them to run the store right quick? Most definitely, but I don't think there's... Fan, you know, there's there's better leggings, you know, but you really there's no fancy leggings or leggings, you know. Let's face it. Well, these kind of are. I guess would they be like? Are they moccasin style? But anyway. Now those so, are slippers, aren't they? Yes. What's on the <laughs> shirt is, already? Outfit number two. See that? By so, the way, the jeans. Right there. I needed a size bigger. Um. Cat hair, uh, pieces of the stuff that, I don't know. Oh, I guess, hold on, let me shut my mouth here. I guess the jeans. They would look, fit. Hold on. If I struggled with them, I'm not in a jeans struggling hold mood on. whatsoever today. That's stupid thing. Just putting it out there. I'm not going to. on it. Right. Oh, I'll just hang on to them. Ah. And when I go down in the. Outfit number two. By the way. The jeans, I needed a Sorry. size bigger. Um, they would fit Why is it if so... I struggled with them. I'm not in a jeans struggling mood whatsoever today. Just putting it out there, not going to happen. Okay, so maybe because they're the skinny type, they're made smaller. Um, so I'll just hang on to them. And when I go down in the size, I'll be able to wear them. So, yeah. All right, guys, so this okay, is... Okay, not to be mean, I personally, you know, I would send the jeans back no matter if I was going to lose weight. Excuse me, this is like... It's starting to go a little... My, you know, your face is getting a little tight here. It's like you got a mask on it, like a facial mask. I'm like... <laughs> Anyways, I would send the jeans back. I would get a credit for something else. Maybe not necessarily get my money back, but what? what's the point of just having them lay around and linger? You're going to forget about them. They're going to get, you know, I don't think she, maybe give them to a subscriber, you know, if there's somebody around, but I would send the jeans back, get a credit. You know, not to be mean, we know she doesn't have a bunch of clothes stating by what she wears, these are all facts and opinions, or excuse me, these are not facts, these are only opinions, but she doesn't seem to have a lot of clothes, so what I'm saying is, probably a pair of jeans for Torrent is a decent amount of money. I would send those jokers back and get a couple t-shirts, but, you know, hey, that's just me. Sweater. I'm wearing it without the tank top because I want to see how see-through it is. Not a fan of the necklace. The necklace <laughs> Looks kind of cheapy Mardi Gras beads. Exactly. And um I love the necklace though. See, I don't dig the necklace. The it looks cheap. And some nice red gems. She she's always on this thing that if the lipstick matches what that's not how I don't like the it kinda looks cheapy, but you know, hey, if she likes it, that's all that matters. The shoes material. look like house um, shoes. Like, that's what I wear around so the house. I would suggest wearing something. Or don't. It's up to you. But this is the sweater. I do like it. I like white sweaters. Sweater's decent, but it is see-through. That was my next thought in theory. 
our girl is a little messy. We all know this. Sometimes she uses her, you know, apparel as napkins. Um, yeah, I, I don't think if I was in the situation, I would have bought cream or white, um, off-white, whatever it is. Um, but there again, that's just me. Try on um, with the rest of the shirts. Yeah, see Man, the leggings, the stripes are all wonky. Guys, I, I... So this is the um, Luna t shirt. Doesn't really go with these leggings. It looks like a night shirt. But it is really cute. And probably wear it around the house, <laughs> around Pete's, because he loves Luna. So just a basic. <laughs> like, do my, my eyebrows are the. The only thing that moved, nothing else. Hey, you want some cheap, uh, cheap, you know what I mean? Um, shirt looks, excuse me, I'm like, yeah, oh, ah. shirt looks like a night shirt, like a nighty, the way it comes down longer. It is cute, it is cute for her, we know, she's a cat lady. And, uh, that song is copyrighted by me, by the way, so, Cat Lady comes from me, okay? Don't be trying nobody to claim cap Cat Lady, okay? She's a cat lady. Alright, guys, so this is the eyelash shirt, which is actually kind of And see, through. it's not me cutting off her head, look. I wish that she would... Pull the tripod back or come up with something. I mean, look, that, even though how we're watching it, that's not your girl, baby. So, I probably would wear Excuse me, a tank top. Because I hike my pants up high enough because I'm petite. To like, I'm not tall. So, I'm like five foot two. <laughs> so. Okay. Anybody else want to take care of this one? Any, anybody in the back? Oh, okay. I guess I'll do it. Um, petite is not just because you're short. It's a whole stature of its own. It's, um, there's petite style clothes. I can't even fit petite style clothes, but, um... You guys get me. I, I think we'll let the back. We'll, we'll let the back people in the back there discuss that. I don't want to s people to see my pants line, you know, and look like. <laughs> oh, I do want to say something else. Um, we're we're getting down here. I know, talking a lot, working on zero energy, getting a second win. Um, no, for real though, real talk. Uh, I'm like, can I even say this? I noticed that it's like sometimes when she lifts her shirt up, there's like a line. It's almost like her pants have created this line that is digging. It's digging in. But, um, yeah, don't pull your pants up so high. Let, let them where they're supposed to be. They'll fit right. They won't, well, they'll fit how they're supposed to fit. And, yeah, I, I noticed that it creates a line, so moving right along. Simon, stop. I love you, buddy, but shit. Up his, his what are you doing, here? bud? This is the robe. I love you too, pussycat. What are you doing? Nice and cozy. Say, I'm not a cat. I'm a dog, honey. Stop, stop. Hold on. We're almost <laughs> done, Bubba. Bubba. Bob quit. Hold on. I got you. I wish you guys could see him. He's Flash looking. Dance. Oh, so Simon one quit. Is Simon. Uh, hold on. Frenchie in the cord for Simon. Hold on, guys. Oh, goodness. Gravy. So, Frenchie. Um, oh, my goodness. Simon, you're clingy. wrecking the video like everybody else this week. 
She's a cat lady. No, 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 no. Oh, hold on. No. I can't sing cat lady. It's Simon Pump Up. If you ever hear me call me Simon, if you ever hear me call him a cat, I mess around with him because he'll go. I said, you're not a cat, Bubbis. You're a dog. Say so you're a little dog, buddy. You're a papa is what you are. So I'm a papa, guys. Say so I'm not a cat, weighty. Flash dance. So this one is a very clingy material. Oh, no. I like how it says good vibes here. It's like a basic shirt, but this makes it less basic. I am getting, like, right now, bangs in hair. Are we not? Uh, man, I'm telling you, hungry fat chick vibes all the way, man. Hungry fat chick vibes. You know, so, um, just very clingy material. I think I prefer it to be a little more flowy, but that's okay. Oh, Lord have mercy. Uh, yeah, so, that's what it looks like. It is clingy, like I said. <laughs> but... Some people like that, some people don't. Just depends. But it is a nice, soft material. And um, I really like it. All right, the last t-shirt to try. She's a cat lady. Oh my God. She literally has a shirt that says cat mom. Sing it, in the, sing it again, guys. Cat mom. <laughs> She loves I it, love guys, because she's a cat lady. The color. Everything. So that's the last one. Just basic t-shirt material, but pretty decent quality, because sometimes Torrid's t-shirt quality is not the greatest. Just depends, especially in the graphic tee department. But this one is a good quality. It's dirty. Doesn't seem like anything will be washing off, but we'll see. Um... Yeah. I really love it. What do you think, BBJ? Oh, no. <laughs> what do you think, BBJ? Oh, good stars you above. <laughs> Come on. She's a cat lady. All right, I can't do it. All right, guys. So, um, thank you for watching this try on haul. All right, all right. No more cat lady. I know. I'm annoying. All right. Without further ado. Um, whoa. Oh my God. I've been a busy bee today. Busy bee. Um, we're going to do a quick sneak peek. I already got everything situated. We're going to look at some people's Halloween costumes, if you feel me. So, shoot me a like. Let me know what do you think of this. Uh, what did you think of the film? What did you think of the cat clothes? And without that, I will see you guys today. I need to get some rest. Get this off my face. We're going to check out something else right quick. And I will see you guys later today. We got some things planned. And I love you guys. Happy Halloween. See you guys later. Have a good day. Happy Halloween. If you don't celebrate, still have a great day. And see you guys later. Kyle.